dual threat in Italy. Mount Etna's shift and Campi Flagre supervolcano activity is once again in the spotlight of global scientists. Two of Europe's most dangerous volcanoes, Mount Etna and Campi Flagre, are showing worrying signs of activity. Recent findings from researchers indicate that this natural phenomenon is no longer a distant threat, but rather an ongoing geological process that demands immediate vigilance and preparedness. Recent research conducted by the National Institute of Geophysics and Volcanology in collaboration with the Geomar Helmholtz Center for Ocean Research in Kiel reveals that the southeastern slope of Mount Etna in Italy is sun, slowly shifting toward the Ionian Sea. This shift is not simply a gravitational movement, but rather the result of a complex interaction between subsurface magma activity and the volcano's internal structural instability. Geophysical data indicate that this phenomenon is creating a dangerous feedback loop where slope shifts cause pressure drops in the magma chamber which could ultimately trigger a major eruption with far more force than usual. Satellite and GPS measurements show that the land surface on Etna's southeastern flank is now stretching and shifting at an increasing rate, which controls the movement of volcanic rock masses toward the sea. Researchers warn that this shift could trigger a chain reaction. If a large portion of Etna's eastern flank were to collapse into the sea, suddenly an event known as sector collapse, the massive displacement of rock masses could generate devastating tsunamis that might sweep across the Mediterranean coastline, underscoring the catastrophic impact of these volcanic activities. Although Mount Etna has long been known as an active but relatively benign volcano, the study confirms that its internal systems are now showing signs of significant instability. Therefore, intensive monitoring of the slope and magma activity beneath Etna is crucial to anticipate potential future disasters. Meanwhile, in the Campania region of southern Italy, seismic activity has increased sharply in the Campi Flegre Caldera, a supervolcano located beneath a densely populated area, including the city of Pozzuoli and parts of Naples. The caldera is about 13 kilometers in diameter and consists of a series of extensive faults rather than a cone-shaped volcano like Etna. Campi Flagre's last major eruption occurred in 1538, drastically changing the landscape and burying several surrounding villages. After centuries of relative calm, signs of activity have resurfaced since the mid-20th century, peaking in 2025. When the caldera floor rose by 1.4 meters, a rise that resembles the pattern preceding past eruptions. Most of this seismic activity is related to underground hydrothermal systems, not major magma movements. Furthermore, the earthquakes remain localized on the same fault segment with no signs of spreading across the caldera. Therefore, despite initial concerns among the people of Naples, the latest data shows no strong indication that Campi Flegre will erupt anytime soon. These two phenomena in Italy demonstrate the dynamic nature of the Mediterranean region. Mount Etna's slow but steady movement and Campi Flegre's reawakening after hundreds of years of dormancy 
both emphasize the fragile balance of nature in this region. Experts emphasize the importance of continuous monitoring, international cooperation, and public preparedness. With increasingly sophisticated satellite technology, GPS sensors, and AI modeling, the world now has better tools to detect early signs of volcanic disasters. Ultimately, however, human vigilance and preparedness remain the primary bulwarks against this potential waking giant in the heart of Italy.